Okay, so I'm going to perform a uh, fix for a forward torsion of the sacrum. Um, it's a manual therapy technique, but since I'm not going to use any direct mobilization for L5, I'm not going to apply any direct mobilization for the SI joint, but I'm just going to allow an isometric contraction of the muscles to pull it for a reciprocal inhibition for the torsion of the sacrum to become unstuck. So first I'll have my patient rotate on their side towards me, and then I'm going to stabilize and find the point of the sacrum. So I'm going to put my two fingers, uh, either my thumb or my index finger, or my thumb and my, or my index finger, or my middle finger, on the base of the sacrum at the site of where I would feel the movement of the spine. And then I'm going to have my patient rotate their upper body forward and they're going to lie almost off of the table so I can feel that change. And then I'm going to bring their legs up into flexion just enough until I feel the sacrum move. So you're not going to move on that movie. Yeah, you're good. So, up until I feel the sacrum slightly move. And that would be about, there it is, okay? And then I'm gonna bring their legs off the table while they're in this flexion. I'm gonna support them on my knee. Support their knees on mine. Just like that. You get that? Yep. Cool, all right. And then I'm going to let go of their legs slightly so they drop until I feel that change at the sacrum. And then what I'm gonna have you do is you're gonna hold your legs in the air for that isometric contraction. So go ahead and hold. Good. And we're gonna get that pull at the sacrum. Do that for 10 seconds. And you can do that up to two to three times. Put them back on the table, reassess, have them lean forward farther, and then go through that technique three times.